up you guys i am back with another video if you don't know my name is Brittany. my name is adam stay over there i am back with another video i am going to talk about five things that help me better myself that i think a lot of people can use i was going through my spiritual journey my healing journey let's do that again when I was going through my spiritual journey, my healing journey, one thing that I noticed that really helped me was with journaling. Journaling has helped me in so many different ways from just writing down my simple thoughts and writing down what I want to my goals and all. Journaling actually does help a lot as far as your feelings, like putting your emotions on paper instead of going out and throwing it at people. Journaling also has helped me identify who I am or what things that I can change about myself. But most definitely like journaling, journaling about your mind, how you feel, what you're thinking about, what you want to do, your dreams and all of that. Journaling has really, really helped me in the long run and actually has brought me here today, which I actually like because now I feel like I'm a bit more positive than I was before. Another thing that has helped me with my um, bettering myself, being the best version of myself, is making routines. I always talk about routines. You know how much I love my routines. I incorporated routines. I incorporated habits in my routines that actually helped me. So, like, as far as journaling, when it comes down to being grateful and stuff and writing down the things you're grateful for, get your ass back in the kitchen, Adam. Go! I told you it was spicy. You don't want to come near me. I fucked up dick. Yeah, break it. Break it so you can have half of it. Because I don't want the whole thing. I'm over here trying to record videos and you over here interrupting me. Anyways, let's get back to what I was talking about. Making routines that I love. So, with routines. It's a little spicy. With routines, when it comes down to certain routines. My morning, my day, and my night. I told you guys that my morning and my nights are the same, but my days are different. And with my morning routines, I actually create the morning two routines that I actually love. Now, don't get me wrong, they do change after a while once I find other things that I like to do. Like my night routines do change sometimes. Like I haven't been, I still shower, but I shower as my last thing instead of, you know, the thing that I do before I journal. So, but making routines that I love to do for morning and night has really helped me and has really helped me better myself and become the best version of myself. Next is quiet time. So when I say quiet time, it's more of, I would say kind of, it's something I kind of incorporate in my morning, day and night routines. Why? Because with quiet time, it actually gives you time to settle. This is when I was talking about balancing your days or balancing like, you know, masculine energy is like organizing, working everything, like doing, doing action, 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 you know, doing stuff and all of that. But as far as feminine energy, feminine energy is more of going with the flow, relaxing and all of that. So what I try to do is balance that out. The way I balance that out is... I do more calming things within my routines. So my morning routine is calming for me. Even though I am on a schedule and it's more organized, I, it's still more calming. It's still more calming for me. Like I do my journaling. I have my quiet time. I sit outside for like probably like five to 10 minutes. It go, it, it's more of, you know, calming. So those are my quiet times. And during the days with my quiet times, what I like to do is read a book or just sit down like nothing. But during the days is more of meditation, sitting down, not like doing anything or reading a book. Those are like the only things that I really do. Sometimes I may journal if I'm going through like a lot of emotions, but those are the things that I like to do. Next up that has helped me better myself and maybe become the best version of myself is organizing my life. When I mean organizing my life has helped me so much, I 
I, I, I'm very grateful and I'm very thankful for that. Now, don't get me wrong, things change, days change and everything, but when I started planning out my days, like what I'm going to do for the day, making my three main events, main events, my three, my three main things to be a priority instead of trying to be like a two, a big to do me. Organizing my days were more like, you know, I have my morning routine set at a, 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 a schedule time, my night routine set at a schedule time, my day routine set at a schedule time, and all. And it actually is very, very helpful. Like, extremely helpful. So, it's extremely helpful. And it actually has helped me in so many different ways. As far as you know, um, being more organized, and when I say being more organized, not trying to put too much in a day, but just remembering like I have some day my boyfriend be a chef or I be in the kitchen. You hear this? And if I tell you guys what he doing, you guys will be like, what the hell? Organizing my days have um, has really helped me and has actually like, you know, made me realize like I can't bunch up everything in one day. So let's focus on one thing. Like with my with my you with my YouTube and lashes and everything. Like lashes, I kinda try to keep that on a three day basis for twelve hours. That is so important for me because if I try to do it throughout a whole week, I miss a lot of key points and a lot of opportunities out through the whole week, especially on Monday and Friday, because Monday and Friday is all my time to really plan and really to do other things. So that is what I like to do. And another thing that has bettered me is, let me go get it, I'll be okay. Now, the last thing that has bettered me is, I know it's a norm, everybody's gonna be like, oh, well, why? No, this is actually something that has bettered me drinking water i i do these a lot more often but i drink a lot of water and maybe like i drink a lot of water i drink a lot of water and when i say water only water like tea you know um only tea and just gallons and water bottles now don't get me wrong sometimes i may drink a ginger ale if i'm about to get drunk i'll drink alcohol you know but during my whole year of getting myself together because yes i did it for one whole year i really didn't really like i talked to people but i really would just focus on me and only on me and it really has helped me and changed my life so for that whole year all i really did was drink water no juice no nothing like only water Speaking of that, I gotta drink something. <clears throat> that is it, you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe when you got. <sighs> Please like and subscribe. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Go over there. Go over there. Me and Nosy. Yes, I'm talking to a damn camera. See, that's why I like when you home. Because this is why I don't record when you home. Tell us, make a YouTube channel.